Duh, man. I'm leaving the division. Let's not talk about it. Unlike, unlike some other teams. Oh, 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 oh. My bad. Still, still um, okay, still, still. How, how do you feel about tomorrow? You know, it's, it's, um, it's a game. Yeah, man. We're just, just looking to get our first goal win. It's, it's an opportunity to improve and an opportunity to just just go out there and compete. You know, in season tournament, and just the, the stakes are high and playing up the street. You know, with your with your uh, in, in, in state rival. So it's cool. You talk preseason about your uh, offseason yoga, your offseason weight training. Do you feel that actually mm -hmm. paying off in real time? How do you oh yeah, for sure. I feel like um um. A knock on wood, but no injuries. No, my, my body's been feeling good through the fatigue and stuff. So I think it's been helping me. How do you feel going against bigger bodies, banging around? Or even uh huh. Uh, definitely feel more comfortable. Um, as my technique keeps improving, I feel like I'll be be better at it and I only get better. Um, I mean, I, I don't know. I, I mean, I don't really know what the expectations were, but um. I know it's still another level I need to get to and, and still improvements to be made, so I'm just going to try, keep trying to go in the right direction. What's the biggest step on the offensive end? Uh, biggest step? On the offensive end. Um, I feel like just, just sureness, just confidence, and just uh, knowing what your role is, knowing where your shots going to come from, and just playing throughout the offense. You know, last year I feel like I was a little unsure, not knowing what I wanted, what to do, you know, so I feel like just confidence and just feel is just, just the step I took. One reason I was about this tournament, and now that you guys are in it, there's something to play for here. What was the feeling early compared to now? The kind of the prize the um, you know, everybody's getting the hang of it a little bit more. You know, as it as it goes on, you kind of look into the rules a little bit more. As it started, I feel like everybody was just like, you know, cool courts play <laughs> and turn the game. But now people are really paying attention more. And um, as the I don't know how it works, but the rounds are like coming up or something like that. So it's just getting more competitive and, and the stakes are getting higher. It seems like guys don't know this way not. To try to figure out how things work, but you mm -hmm. players know there's some money involved. How much yeah. does that incentivize kind of mm -hmm. competitiveness overall in the NBA? Um, definitely. You know, it's just a just a um little token to get, and just just something you can help yourself with, help uh, help your family, help the people around you, and it's um it's a lot of money. The bragging rights would be nice too, right? Yeah, for sure, definitely. If you are able to advance, it kind of puts you on a stage where more people get to see you guys. Is that kind of an opportunity to show the league maybe how far this group has been so far? Oh yeah, definitely. Just the togetherness and the improvements we made from last year. You know what I mean? And just um, you know, us us advancing this tournament, us keep keep um, keep winning games, and this would just definitely put the put um, more eyes on us and just just help us in, in the long run. Now that you guys are about to turn the page on November, what, what have you learned about your teammates in this mm -hmm. specific team early in this year? Um, basically, that everybody has the same goal. You know, everybody wants to win. Everybody's willing to sacrifice sacrifice to win games. You know, and um, you know, and that's a, that's the main thing that I'm that I'm noticing a lot. Oh! Tari said there was some cheating going on in the drill that y'all did at the end with the uh -huh. score. What, what happened there? Um, I don't know. Just, just shooting, just trying to win. I don't know. I don't keep up with the score. You're getting some more of those kind of big post face up looks that you got. I think compared to last year, does that help you get more into a rhythm and a flow in that game now? Um, yeah, for sure. You know, I feel like I'm really effective down there, and um, teammates giving me the ball there, trusting me there, coaches putting me there, and um, my confidence is only going to go up from there, and just, um, just. Learning what to do there, learning how to um, how to get there, how to get more touches there, and just just playing through it definitely helps me. Any kind of Last day, one, please. Any kind of day to day or game day shooting drills or anything you've been working on to refine your shot? Um, nah. I mean, just trying to shoot the same shot every time, be consistent, you know, and not um not have ten different shots like my dad say. So just just trying to keep it consistent. Last one. It's been forty eight hours since Auburn, Alabama. Uh huh. What was that like for you watching that? that uh, I was just getting over it till you brought it up. So. I'm back to my back to my depressive state. <laughs> Appreciate y'all. Thank you.